Hey everybody, this is Oscar, and today we're going to be taking a look at Atom, the performance and production controller from Personas. You should really go to my.personas.com and make sure that you register your hardware, so this way you have access to download Studio One Four Artist, as well as Universal Control, so you can update the firmware so that you always have the latest and greatest on your hardware. So the first thing you want to check for is the LED logo right at the top of Atom. If it's green, that means you're in normal MIDI mode. So you can pretty much use it in any music application that you'd like. Okay, so I've opened up Studio One, and you'll immediately see that what was once a green Studio One logo is now blue. So that means we have Studio One open, it's connected to Studio One, and we're ready to go. Okay, so we've set up a brand new song in Studio One. We're pretty much ready to go. But just as a little side tip, if for some reason your logo is still green, you should go over to the Studio One menu, Go over to Preferences, and in your External Devices tab, make sure that you see Atom here, and if you double click it, you'll see that our Receive From is set to Atom, and our Send To is set to Atom. Now once again, this will happen automatically, everything should be good, but once again, sometimes weird things happen, so if you need to manually set it up, you can do it this way. So that's it. Please check out our other videos. We'll see you again soon.